Hello everyone and welcome to your daily stock report brought to you by qualitystocks.net where performance is tracked daily. I'm Kathy Rankin and yes it is Friday, February 1st, right before Super Bowl weekend and we're bringing you the latest news from around the markets. Today's headline news are brought to you by Pressure Biosciences Incorporated. Pressure Biosciences is focused on developing products based on its proprietary pressure cycling technology for life sciences applications. The innovative technology utilizes hydrostatic pressure, which cycles between ambient and ultra-high levels to rapidly and proficiently disrupt cell membranes and tissues to remove nucleic acids, proteins, and small molecules from plant and animal materials. Now let's get right into the headline news from Thursday. Altria Group said it would spin off its international tobacco business on March 28th, freeing it to pursue cigarette sales more aggressively outside the United States by separating it from its American counterpart. The two tobacco units each make Marlboros, one of the world's top-selling cigarette brands. The details of the spin-off, tentatively approved by the Altria board last August, were announced as the company reported that fourth quarter profit fell 26% from year early resu results that were boosted by a gain related to a reorganization in 2006. And now for a look at the small cap news that Quality Stocks is tracking for you. Small cap headlines are brought to you today by Cord Blood America Incorporated. Cord Blood America is focused on becoming the most respected stem cell preservation company in the world. The company plans to achieve this goal by educating expectant parents, families with a history of disease, critically ill patients, and all others who wish to learn about their life-saving services. Today, the QualityStocks.net daily newsletter would like to highlight Interconnect Incorporated as our one to watch at 95 cents with a 52-week trading range of 75 cents to $1.20. Interconnect is the maker of Interconnect software programs, providing document management, content management, collaboration, search, and security. The company recently launched its Interconnect software into the Asia-Pacific market at the BEA World 2007 Shanghai, along with the release of their latest software revision 8.8 .8 for global market availability. Geopharma Incorporated was at $2.85 with over 16,000 shares traded. Geopharma announced an agreement with the University of South Florida Research Foundation to acquire worldwide patent rights of a diagnostic technology for early stage detection of ovarian cancer using patients' urine samples. Edgewater Research Partners initiated coverage this month on Geopharma Incorporated. Gulf Western Petroleum Corporation is up 3% with 60,000 shares traded. Gulf Western Petroleum Corporation engages in the exploration and development of oil and natural gas reserves and recently announced that the O'Neill Smith No. 1 four-point flow test has been completed and is now flowing into the sales line along with the two previously drilled wells in this project which are also hooked into the sales line. And that's it for our newsmakers today. Stay tuned right here to the Quality Stocks Daily Newsletter for the latest news and commentary from small cap to large cap and everything in between brought to you by QualityStocks.net. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Kathy Rankin. Have a fantastic Super Bowl weekend, and we'll see you again Monday right here on the Daily Report. This transmission is coming to you. You've got it.